ruin has come to our family. Hello, and welcome to another episode of Darkest Dungeon. Before we get started, we have a, another new name for an existing character. And that is Moira Midnight for our Falconer. And she wanted to be purple, so there she is. So she's not going to see action, at least on this mission, because she is in there getting distressed. So we are going to the Warrens, that's right, to get the Golem's guys. So we've already tinkered all of these guys out, so let's go ahead and provision. So a short trip into the Warren. So probably a stack of food will be fine. Let's do a stack of torches. Maybe like three shovels, three keys. Um, let's bring like four in of venom, maybe three bandages, three of these. Let's bring a couple. I don't know if there's anything to use holy water here for, but uh, I'll bring them anyway. Anyway, we are once again basically broke, but, uh, well, getting an antiquarian would be nice about now. Just saying. Tunnels are often blocked by, uh, by piled stones and bodies. To prosecute our war against the swine, we must first scout their squalid homes. Excellent beginning. Mind that such missteps are the exception and not the rule. Now. Okay, this is holy water. Glad I brought some. You can get, I mean, a ton, but A. The match is struck. A blazing star is born. Nothing, alright. So this is 90% of rooms. Well, alright. So, port again, portraits, I think I'm going to kind of keep. Ah, uh, we need busts too, don't we? So, these two, I think I'm going to try to keep as high priority um, heirlooms. Nothing. What? Now I wish I had more holy water. I mean, not that we've been getting a whole bunch of stuff from it, but... Well, we can go over here to, uh... Yes, yes. Oh, hunger. Okay. Another one of these things. Sixty, sixty, ninety. All right. Blood soaked pages torn from a journal, three out of six. The wound is starting to fester. The flesh around it is gray, flaking and rigid, almost scale like. So I write this my breathing has taken on a hollow timber and is more labored. My compatriots are laughing and tell me not to worry. It's just the salt mist in the air that pervades these caverns. Little do they know. I guess I'll we'll grab Such the blood. A bird in the finery risks life and limb. Wow. 
Want to try to get rid of the drummer if we can. These guys have high bleed, so we might as well... Pretty high stun here. Uh, all right. So okay, let's see. We have five to ten. Three to five. And five to ten. Chance to crit nine percent. 10%. Annihilated. Bringing ears. Blurred vision. The end approaches. Uh these guys have any prot? They don't. Ow. Oh, I meant to do an individual heal there. Oh well. Uh, we can try to. Well, uh, yeah, okay. This doesn't do damage. We can try to. Yeah. We got one. Okay, this blade's not great. So this is now 15% chance to crit. I'll do this, because he's gonna not have his turn next time. Ah, he went first. Nice dodge. I should move the individual heal first. That's what makes more intuitive sense to me. Continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. Uh, yeah, sure, let's do this. Excellent. Just to get rid of them. More blood, more money, more portraits. All right. So let's check out. What is this? Tanned human flesh. I'm actually not sure. I'm going to leave it alone. Another one of these. May we find victory. All right. I have to say, we haven't found much cash here. And 
books. Well, all right, fine. The swine folk's labyrinth may yet prove to be navigable. I'm not gonna really have enough money to do any sort of in-town stuff. Hey, we have our first level two, Jenny. Plus 10 stress damage received, that's bad. Demon hater, that's good. Once our estate was oh, the one envy of this land. Reported. All right. So, the bank. We need 50 of these. We have 22. Um, so we, we have a good start. But I don't feel comfortable really doing anything as far as disease or whatever. Um, with only the money we have. I don't know if we can upgrade anything. Okay, let's see. Okay, so I'm just thinking, so the, the stagecoach needs, I think, these two. Which require 41. Whoops. Uh, 41 crest, which we have. And then it requires, I think, this one. Which is 38. So, you know, so, so we need, what, 79 crests? This is going to take a lot of our portraits, unfortunately. Um, and I it look like we need the deeds as well, so... Bus, we might, uh... Oh, another Vestal. That's good. Do I want to take another Occultist? Pious and unrelenting. I may hold off on the Occultist for now. But this other, uh, yeah. Witch Heater. Alright, hot to trot. So, a lot of stuff on first round. Because one reason why I'm kind of hesitating really filling up new people is because, you know, I'd like to get that upgrade. All right, let's see. Antiquarian only, plus 10 dodge. That's not too bad. Itinerant cook. Plus 50 damage, okay. Plus 20% bleed skill chance, that could be okay. Plus 100% food consumed. I'm not sure about that. Plus 10 damage to melee skills generally. That's pretty good. This is a short one as well. Vestal only. Ooh. Plus 8 speed on the first round. Plus 2 speed after that. Minus done skill chance though. So, maybe... Um, this is a medium run, though. I'd rather do another short one here. Plus 5 dodge for the Musketeer. Plus 15 damage if in position 1. So I think it's between this one... I, I, I'm leaning towards this one just because it's a more general one. Um, plus 10 damage to melee skills. So, 90% of room short in the wield. Who all do we still have level 0? Um, unfortunately... We could try taking our uh, cataphract out, I guess. So this is a move forward one. This is an... This is an individual heal, but also grants... Oh, grants themselves one plot. Back three, four, three. Do I have a back one? This one. 
but you can't use it in the first position, which is kind of weird for someone doing a back one. Just like this one, you can't use it in the in the back position, even though it's a forward one. If I mean, if I'm understanding this right, which is kind of a weird. I'll see how this. I'll, I'll see. Um, Esther's not probably going to be the greatest in the wield. Uh, so let's let's see who we can maybe get up to level two if possible. Um, Ramdor maybe. Now if we do Ramdor, um, the problem here. I mean, I guess I could thrust to get back into the first position if I'm the Cataphract. Um, but they have to be in the first position to heal. Which is kind of a problem. We do have the thing that can move them all the way up, for the up to the front. So I'm just thinking, if we start him in the second position so he can repose forward, who would we have? We could send Kitty back out. He does well both in the second or third. Uh, which then begs the question, who goes out in the back? Um, she has a lot of stress. But most of her best stuff is from the back. Alright, I'm going to kit these people out and then be right back. Okay, I'm back. So, on our Cataphract, I'm giving the Crumbling Shell for the 25% Prot and Bloodied Fetish, mainly for the Blight Resist. Um, but they also get Bleed Resist as well. On our Houndmaster, I'm taking the Warrior's Cap for plus 5 Accuracy to Melee Skills and the Sunward Isles Houndmaster Trinket. So, we get plus 4 damage to Melee Skills um, and... Minus the stun chance, but I don't even have that enabled. I don't even have it unlocked. Um, so that says on blackjack and target whistle. So we do have target whistle. Um, so this is the uh, marks and reduces prot. It also debuffs their target 25% damage. So that's pretty good. That might be a good reason to use this. Uh, on Ramdor, our Highwayman, I'm bringing out the Bloody Club for so extra damage, bleed resist, and uh, the Lured Ivories, which gives a bonus crit chance to bleeding, stunned, and marked. I don't think anyone in this group can stun, but we might have bleeding and mark. And then on Moira, uh, I'll bring this, especially since she has skittish. So this kind of eliminates half of the skittish problem. And also this to get rid of Blight, uh, to give her some Blight Resist. Um, so another short mission, this time into the Wield. So let's give back a couple food here. I wonder, we must have gotten food from the Cataphract, I guess. Is there anything that uses herbs in the wheel? I can't remember. I don't think there's anything that uses holy water, though. We have six blood just from collecting it out on these missions. All right, let us embark. I'll try to remember to use dog treats.
I knew all these paths once. Now they are as twisted as my own ambitions. All right. <laughs> no. They are a bit twisted, aren't they? Here we go. So this debuffs target. These two have prot. So what, uh, what does the other one of this do? Minus an accuracy, possible bleed. Didn't get it. So let's do this. Alright. So this moves back three. We don't want to do that. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Ow. Going back on her already, eh? So... Skill mount versus marked. All right. So he's dead. I would like for our cataphract to go. We'll have to see what the role is. Nope. All right, fine. Be wary. Triumphant pride precipitates okay. a dizzying fall. Okay. We could try to go up and around to avoid this fight, although <laughs> fights might be where we get money, so maybe I do want to go. If I'm going to do that, let me check to see what this is. Okay. More money. More blood. Trampled journey, three out of four. He well, dear friend, exemplary warrior, a survivor of the king's wars and many sorties in these halls, met an ignoble end. We were wary, Howell and I, as we searched for sanctuary. Wariness, it appears, has a murderous streak. It blinded him to the mechanism that trapped the spikes which eviscerated him. I held him as his essence slipped away, another giant fallen in our mad pursuit. I'm alone now, wary but unbowed, I press on. Right. At least he didn't keep the stuff. The way is lit. The path oh, is these clear. Dudes. Require only the strength to follow it. Oh, I didn't move his back, did I? Oh well. Excellent. Confidence. 
resistance surges as the enemy crumbles. So this should be one to four. Be nice, got the four. So we have plus 10 prot, minus 10 prot. Another one falls. Let's heal back here again. We've got an interesting bowl there. All right, got the two. But she's mostly back up now, so that's was nice dodge. Be gone, fiend. Hey, portraits, we could use that. Basically everything but bus was a priority, wasn't it? Have six torches left. This is shovel, I believe. All right. Impressive haul. If you value such things. Not. These guys, we might want to use that minus damage thing against. Press this advantage. Give them no quarter. Nice. Continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. Five to ten, five to eleven. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. Ow. That's the problem with this, is we get the minus ten prop. One. Alright. Let's also do this. Get rid gets rid of prot and damage. Let's heal here again. That's a lot better. Now I have plus 20 prot and my minus 20 prot. Um, there's not a hell of a lot you can do here. At least got a damage on. this momentum push on to the task's end uh this one, I think we oh we haven't uh, you, uh okay good that didn't help us at all all right I'm gonna try to use my dog treats on the last next two battles because they may be our last two battles
Uh, yeah, herbs. Alright, food. I'll take it, I guess. The match is struck. A blazing spider is born. Right. Oh, I didn't. Whoops. Executed with impunity. Back to the pit. It's kind of unfortunate because... Okay. Another abomination cleansed from our lands. Decided not to use the dog treats because these are kind of so okay. Right, that that works. Success. Lightstone so could be useful. Or is it I'll leave the bus because those are. The light? Well, I guess I could have replaced something in my inventory. I probably should have. I didn't even think about that. More of this. More food. Right. Definitely dog treats. Nice. Let's mark. Oh, I didn't move again. Let's see if we can get, uh, mm. Let's see if we can get rid of one of these back guys. Dog treat. We can get this if we crit, maybe. Mark him to reduce his prop, reduce his damage. Ah. Okay, let's get some of the better heals going, maybe. dead. Ah. Uh. I'll see if I can get another heal here. That's a bit better. There we 
go. These nightmarish creatures can be felled. They can be beaten. Wealth beyond measure. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. Beyond measure. Archer's ring, plus five accuracy to ranged skills. All right. Oh, we can see what's here. Uh, bandages, right? Which we just ran out of, I guess. We can still try to touch it. Money, a little bit. Nice dodge. Oh, are we out of torches? All right. Not. All right. Paths and roads bring soldiers and supplies. Let them arrive on Harry. Still not a lot of money. So Ramdor is now level two. Infamous less likely to have a good time. Uh. Plus ten healing done while camping. All right. Plus 15% death blow resist while bleeding. Okay. Fear of Yokai. Yikes. Plus 2 speed of torch above 75. That's really nice. Too bad we don't have the money to lock any of it in. Irritant. The sum. Right. A sanguine memory. One reason why I'm trying to get people up to level 2 so we can go out there. Uh, 8,000. I might be able to put someone in for a quirk. Nervous is kind of bad. Reduces treatment cost. The front line of this war is not in the dungeon, but rather... I reduced it by like 300. Mind. Why the leather straps? All right. I'm not sure there's anyone here that I necessarily want to grab. No new class. We still don't have a man-at-arms. We don't still don't have an antiquarian. We still don't have a jester. Uh, maybe we should do this. Increase the number of available heroes. That Four way we'll get five. Foolishly seeking fortune and glory in this domain of the damned. All right. Let's see what we have for next time. Highwayman only. Trapped his iron chance. I mean, he or they already usually have pretty good. Plus four dodge. Minus five stress healing received. That's eh. Plus 20 damage versus flight. That could be good. That's a short mission too. Snare drop. Plus one crit. Plus 10% stress healing done. Plus 30, 30% stress healing received from crits. So that might be good for a jester, I suppose, but... Plus 20 blight resist, plus 20 minus... Okay, that's eh. Ooh, this is good. We have to kill an Onamazu. Oh, isn't this that... Uh, the one room battle? Yeah... I don't know if I want to do that this time. But uh, I'm trying to remember what that is. It might be a good thing to go to for next time, though. I don't know what this town event is. Uh... Let's maybe try to bring some level 1s to uh, level up.
Maybe we can bring our level zero. Uh, one thing I didn't even think of checking was if we bring her out, what's her. Okay, I think we'd only. Well. Yo, know, I'd probably want to unlock Dazzling White. Those are all level two, level two, level two. Uh, he needs to, both of these guys need their armor. Now, the good thing about this one is we won't really need, we won't need food, we won't need, well, we might bring a few torches, but, um, if I remember, their thing is blight. <laughs> Um, so, um, I think what I'll do is I'll kind of end it here, and then, uh, I'll show out everyone's, uh, loadout at the beginning of the next episode. So, thank you for watching, and I will see you here next time.